Welcome to part two of creating corselet and built-in bra for a custom gown. If you haven't watched part one of this video, I encourage you to do so. Let's get started. So this is what the bra looks after I cut away the side seams and those side panels. I still have pretty much the rest of the bra. So let's see what I'm doing with this now. I've laid out my pieces on my power net off screen. I added a sample piece as you can see on the side over there as well as use the original bra area to create my second panel piece. I added a inch on one side and also you can see I added this additional pattern where it starts off pretty wide and then goes in narrow. So this is what it looks like when I have all my pieces cut. You're going to need four pieces in total for each side of this extension that you're going to add into the bra because they're going to be put together uh, front sides facing each other so they have additional reinforcement. So you're going to need four pieces for each side of this panel. What I did off screen was um, pin this to my client, both the bra area as well as the muslin area, and that's how I was able to create these pieces. Right now, I'm just really trying to perfect everything and cut off the excess fabric that's anywhere and make sure that the pieces, when I uh, am ready to sew them together, that all the pieces match nicely. So as you can see, I'm using my hip ruler to create that line that I need, as well as making sure there's enough uh, seam allowance available for me to attach the pieces. As you can see, I'm using the chalk and just making sure everything is nice and even and that there's room for me to add that seam allowance to attach the pieces evenly. I have my line here and again, I'm just gonna go in and just cut off any additional fabric. That way all my uh, lines and seams match up nicely with each other. Okay, I'm going to do the same thing to the side seam. I'm going to leave a little bit extra at the top just in case because it's always better to have a little bit more you can cut off than something having to be attached later. This is what it looks like after I've added my extension with the power net. You can see that there's a little bit of space there for me to return that piece back to the bra as well as a nice extension. And because the power net and the original bra match so well, it doesn't look too much like it was extended. I just want to jump ahead because I want you guys to see what you're going to be needing in the future. This sort of uh, gorgeous satin fold over elastic that you can find in bra making as well as some elastic elastic to one inch in width, nice and sturdy. You're going to need that for some of the things we're going to be doing in part three of this video. So I just want to make sure you guys have that as well as the original pieces to the bra so that you can also attach it. So keep track of those things for the next part of this video, which is part three. So we're at the sewing machine and I just want to show you guys what I'm doing here. I have my sides facing each other and I'm going to be to begin to sew uh, the power net to the original bra area. As you can see, it's um, as even as it's going to be. And I'm just gonna make sure these seams are facing each other when it's all said and done. I used about a half inch seam allowance to connect my pieces. And again, I'm gonna be doing this twice for each side. And once I'm done, I'm going to make sure that those uh, seams are facing each other so those seams are going to be kissing each other so that we don't have any fabric kind of like hanging out there um, once we want to attach it to the corselet. Okay, I just want to show you guys briefly what we're working towards. This is the side back panel. Okay, and that is it for part two of this video. I will see you guys at part three. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. Videos are uploaded weekly covering dressmaking, fashion, lectures, and more. Enroll in Ladycloth U on Teachable for dressmaking and fashion design courses. See you again soon.